Hello, hello again. So, as you can see, today we got Eternal Volume 2. I was going to make this short and sweet, but the more I paged through it, the more I found more things. I'm like, you guys should see this. This is kind of awesome. So, just as sparkly as the one before. The nice, not sparkly on the sides, which we all know. Not, well, yeah. Still sparkly on the back. I really still like those silhouettes. I don't care how many volumes I have. I just really like it. Big, heavy. Heavy casing. Casing. I don't know. Dust jacket. There we go. We'll call it that. And a little picture on the inside. I found over the last few years with these covers coming out like this that I end up kind of um, coveting, <laughs> I guess is lack of a better word, um, these particular cover images because they're just that pretty. And you'll have to excuse my hand. <sighs> the phone was dying, so I'm down to one hand again. So we've got the nice canvas pages. So we've got like three color photos in here and this one actually goes all the way through the first arc so that makes me a little happier because I was rereading um, my earlier editions of Sailor Moon last weekend I was, I was willing to bet I was gonna have to wait until volume three um, but apparently I'm wrong so we got that image I've always kind of liked that image um, still the glossy pages and all that good stuff. I I do like the extra detail in these in these uh volumes. Anyway, it just seems like some of these little filigree details um just stand out more. So we've got those and then with every chapter there's another color page. I've always kind of liked that one too, but it's not one of my favorite art book images. Um, it's just always kind of been like, oh, that's pretty, but there's other ones that I like more than that. Oh, going to the moon. And then I don't know what's going on here. Her shirt is pink at, in the top and then it's blue and then it's purple. <laughs> Yeah, it's still, it's still pretty, but, you know, this one I really, really like. I mean, so you've got those two, and it just looks really kind of awesome with superimposed on top of this picture as well. Um, yeah. So, poor Luna, she's so worried. So, I mean, there's not, there's a few more color images, and that's why I'm kind of slowly paging through it. And you can see what's, what's going on. In the next chapter. You know, for the longest time, the first time I saw that, I thought it was, Valentine's, not Christmas, and then I saw her little pine tree thing and the holy day. I'm like, oh no, no, that's supposed to be a Christmas image. Never mind. Oh, we'll pass through these pages quicker. I mean, if you guys have read them, then you know what's going on. I like seeing this picture spread out over the two. Though I'm a little biased because I have the um, the art books, most of them anyway. So if I wanted to see it again, you know, maybe better spread out or something, I could I could just pull out one of my books. Is this side? Oh yeah. Fall in love again. Never really 
And the picture's okay, but... And then we got that one. And I've never quite understood why he always has a... Why they gave him a skull cane topper. I mean, that's kind of morbid. But, you know, to each their own. Uh, let's see. So, we're coming to the end of the battle. I do really like this page, though. I've always enjoyed seeing that one in color. Um, I have a couple other editions where I've seen that one. Although, you know, I noticed, so she's holding a, a diadem there, or tiara, take your pick. And we never actually, I think there's only one picture with her on it, and it's somewhere in one of the art books. And that's always kind of a bummer. So I had to really think about it before I saw that. So, I don't have anything else new. Just, yeah, volume two of this. So, yeah, the new definitive edition of the classic. So, yeah, no, I guess I, I lied. It is short and sweet. Oh, I I double lied. There's there's the sparkles on the side, too. They just weren't showing up earlier. So, um, volume three comes out in January, and then volume four comes out, I want to say April, like mid-April, early April. Uh, I think it's mid-April. And then I think volume five, the Venus cover, probably comes out sometime next summer. Um, but if you're collecting the little Bunko volumes, um, I think there's two more. I think five and six are coming out next month, and then probably seven and eight in January. So on and so forth. At least I think that's what I saw on Amazon. Over on the um, Japanese Amazon site. So if you don't know what that is, that's Amazon.co.jp. And you can find those little volumes on there. So anyway, until next month. Later.